Super Bowl 28 between the Bills and Cowboys turned out to be one for the record books. The Dallas will want to read the storyline forever, while Buffalo must face up to the fourth chapter in a long line of defeats. To Atlanta and the Georgia Dome, former Jets great Joe Namath on hand for the ceremonial coin flip won by the Cowboys. Opening kick, Cowboys rookie Kevin Williams took it and made an outstanding run back into Buffalo territory. 50-yard return led to a field goal and an early 3-0 lead. Let me just do the best that I can with this. I'm going to try to take it all the way to the, you know, to the end zone. And I uh, saw a little crease, man. I was out the door. I said, oh, oh it's, uh, it's going to be on now. Bells came right back on their first possession. Steve Christie stroked a 54-yard field goal, longest in Super Bowl history to tie it at three. Still first quarter. Thurman Thomas on the shovel pass, stripped by Leon Lett. Darren Woodson recovered for Dallas, leading to another field goal and a 6-3 lead. Then a break for the Bills on the punch. Dallas rookie Dave Thomas called for running into Chris Moore. A five-yard penalty and a Buffalo first down. Bills went on an impressive 80-yard, 17-play drive, ending in the second quarter on Thomas's four-yard score. Bills had their first lead at 10-6. Late in the half, the Cowboys driving for the go-ahead score. Troy Aikman, who was not sharp, pressured by Bruce Smith into a bad throw. Nate Odom picked it off, killing the threat. Bills kicked the field goal to go up 13-6 at the half. The Cowboys were down, but still very confident at the break. I think they came out emotionally as they could possibly be. They came out and played a great first half, but I, th I think they kind of blew their load. For the Cowboys. Third quarter, Bills first possession. Thurman Thomas coughed it up in a heat. The fumble was scooped up by former Bruin James Washington, who smelled pay dirt. Washington weaved his way through the tacklers and found his way to the end zone for a 46-yard score. It was tied at 13, and the Cowboys had the momentum less than a minute into the second half. He scores a touchdown to tie the game back up, and uh, then the defense, they played exceptional from that point on. And then we were able to get the running game going, and, and then once we got up on them, uh, we were able to Thank pick and choose what we wanted to do. Cowboys started to dominate on their next possession. Emmett Smith carried seven times for 61 yards, capped by this 15-yard score. Dallas led for good at 20 to 13. Fourth quarter now. Any hopes of a Bills comeback ruined right here. Kelly intercepted by Washington, making his second big defensive play. With his heroics, Washington was a surprise MVP runner-up. This is an opportunity that I had to showcase my talent. It doesn't matter. I mean, more things have come to me because people saw what I did. The MVP, Emmett Smith, who scored on fourth and goal to make it 27 to 13 after Washington's interception. The Cowboys went on to make a splash in NFL history, becoming the first team to win the Super Bowl after an 0 and 2 start. Cowboys 30, Bills 13. Uh, considering that uh, I missed the first two ball games and uh, was able to capture the third rushing title and uh, went through some injuries and so forth, was able to endure through those. And, uh, you know, to be on a great team is just a wonderful feeling and uh, it's a great accomplishment, uh, accomplishment for uh, everybody, I believe. As for the Bills, dubious history. The only team to make four straight Super Bowls, the only one to lose four straight Super Bowls. We're hurt. Uh, that, that we could have played a lot better. Uh, and then again, you know, we're, I think some players might be embarrassed by the situation that we've lost four straight Super Bowls. But uh, hopefully, you know, you know, this team has been through so much, and hopefully uh, we won't let this get us down for a long time.